hey what's going on you know who it is you know what it is all right you guys um you know i love the fact that every once in a while when i make these videos ether and eminem and 50 cent because they fans is just like really retarded especially the white ones but the end of the day uh they they carry no weight nobody cares what these angry mayonnaise nation members have to say they just mad because they worry just like other lamestream media because for years they had this notion that we supposed to say Eminem, the greatest rapper of all time and the best rapper on the planet when he isn't. And then just like a typical white person, they love to come talk about, well, so-and-so said this and so-and-so said that. First of all, Big Daddy Kane ain't been in the news since when? Y'all motherfuckers didn't give a damn about Big Daddy Kane till he said that. Now, all of a sudden, you guys care about what Big Daddy Kane said. Now, I guarantee you if Big Daddy Kane would have said said that Eminem ain't, ain't the GOAT and all that kind of stuff, then y'all would have been saying, well, who cares what Big Daddy Kane thinks? And as far as this shit about, well, if Eminem was black, look, you white boys and you white hoes need to just stop it because you sound ridiculous, Okay. Just stop trying to play the reverse racism card because first of all, there ain't no such thing as no reverse racism. Any damage that's been caused on this planet is been due to via, you know, white people because of your destructive mentality. And I'm just keeping it 100. Stop trying to come over here trying to cyber bully. First of all, you motherfuckers can't cyber bully me. I'll say whatever I want to say about Eminem and it don't bother me. And then y'all be killing me saying that you butt hurt. You the one that's butt hurt. You the one that's getting upset. I'm fine. When I make these videos, you know, I load them and kick back and that's and do my thing. At at the end of the day, I'm I'm starting to get it now. I'm really starting to believe that Eminem is paying these these rappers and promising them shit. If they say, okay, man, just say Eminem. Because first of all, Rakim, he taking away his respectability. First of all, comparing Eminem to Muhammad Ali is insulting to black people and to Muhammad Ali. For real. To eat, and then comparing Eminem to Kobe Bryant. Come on, man, stop it. And then the typical white dude to get on here and say at least Kobe Bryant didn't sexually assault first of all kobe Bryant didn't sexually assault that nasty ass uh white tramp okay get your facts straight okay just just stop it now i guess eminem is having withdrawals or something coming off that terrible performance at you know the oscars that basically nobody was feeling people was looking like why is he here but yeah, for Rakim to say that Eminem is the Muhammad Ali of rap, that's just so disrespectful. And not, not even the most racist white person in the world would believe something so absurd. For real. Eminem don't stand for nothing. Eminem ain't even, like I said, when have Eminem ever spoke on anything? What, George Bush? Who cares about George Bush? Then Eminem is buddies with Donald Trump. Them just songs where he be trying to diss Donald Trump is fake. Donald Trump used to in introduce Eminem at shows. And Donald Trump was a Republican back then. But then again, I guess Eminem would support Donald Trump, one white supremacist to another. Um, let me explain something to, to you clear people. What does a racist do when he's discovered and exposed for being a racist he tries to align himself with the very people that he is prejudiced against donald trump go look at his record been sued for racial discrimination on more than one occasion so he tries to align himself with black people you know like all them coons them them coon preachers that's another reason why the that's another reason why basically black people started to stay clear of the church because they knew it was easy for the church to sell out the black community as long as they got a contribution 
So like I said, same thing with Eminem. So you think I'm supposed to be impressed that he put out D12? Which the only reason why those albums got promoted is because he was on them. And then in case you guys don't know, even the members of D12 said that Eminem was sort of like taking out verses that he thought was better than his. Okay. I'm I'm just keeping it 100. You, you clear people are wasting your time. And before you sit up there and say somebody jealous, like I said, who would be jealous of y'all? Who would be jealous of people that got skin like y'all's, that got hair like y'all, and smell like y'all? For real. I'm I'm just I'm I'm just keeping it 100. I have melanin in me. I don't have to worry about dying of skin cancer. And I'm about to change my diet because I done did more research, and I know that y'all purposely creating hair products and. <laughs> And y'all distributing food in the areas where we live at that could possibly, you know, shorten our life expectancy. Yeah. See, the thing is, you guys are mad because black media, like I said, is on the rise. Because now we don't pay attention to what you guys say. We don't pay attention to what you tell us. We don't listen to what, what you try to put out because we know it's not factual. Do you think I care what some some white person say when he come on here talking shit because he mad because I don't care about Eminem? You think I'm losing any sleep? You white. OK. Kill yourself for real. I don't go, go, go to sleep. You know what I'm saying? Upset because some white dude came on here talking shit, saying all these little homosexual references and shit. You know what I'm saying? And it just goes to show you that you guys would literally let Eminem pipe y'all, you male Eminem fans, and particularly the white ones. But then again, he did do that little disgusting ass little, uh, you, you know, snippet or whatever you want to call it, where he was, you know, pretending that dudes was giving you know, men giving each other oral sex. So, I mean, this is how Eminem get down. And he didn't make references that he got sexually assaulted and that white man didn't put they, you know, you know, in his mouth. So, like I said, why are you getting upset with me? Because I have a difference of opinion. Once again, your white opinion don't have no weight here. You don't come telling me that I have to like Eminem because you say so. Then I know some white dude get mad and go ahead. I don't care about you thinking I'm a racist and all that type of shit. Because first of all, there ain't no such thing as no black racist whatsoever. Don't exist. Okay. It's this thing now where you can voice your opinion. I don't have to agree that Eminem is the greatest rapper of all time. And I don't like that these so-called uh celebrities are sitting up here basically lying and manipulating the public real talk we already know that most celebrities are full of shit we already know it's been said on several occasions that you have to compromise yourself if you want to stay and remain in hollywood that's just the bottom line like i said before eminem's Oscar performance, a lot of people wasn't feeling it. You know what I'm saying? And then Eminem allegedly using Botox to try to continue to look younger and all that type of shit. And then got that funny ass, scrawny looking beard and shit. So I mean, just like, you know, uh, I mean, it is what it is. Like I said, how, how can a white guy be better than any black rapper when he stole from black people who created this hip hop shit? This is our shit. We made this shit. How are you better or the best at something when you stole from people that don't look like you? When you stole from people that you trying to emulate. And I'm going to keep reminding people of those racist ass songs that Eminem made calling black people niggers and moon crickets and, 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 and spear chuckers and all that type of shit. I don't give a fuck about how old he was when he made it he was well over the age of 21 
And then, like I said, this cracker had the audacity to try to call Lauren Hill racist. Like I said, once again, ain't no no such thing as a black racist. He tried to insinuate Lauren Hill was racist towards white people when all she said was she don't make her songs for everybody. If you black, more than likely your target audience is black people. Okay? If you're a Mexican singer that's seen mariachi, is your target audience pretty much Hispanic or Mexican people? So, how is that racist? Like I said, Eminem didn't got away with a lot of shit that he shouldn't have got away with. But not anymore. Because, see, they didn't have no YouTube, no social media when he did all the shit that he did. Because I'm telling you right now. Like I said, if you a black person that support Eminem, something is seriously wrong with you. But then again, like I said, it's because of you Negroes why people don't respect us. You sitting up here, here riding for a dude that then disrespected your people on numerous occasions. Like I said, I'm not finna argue with you clear people about Eminem. I'm gonna continue to make these videos. Nobody, like I said, man, that shit don't bother me that y'all be talking shit. You ain't gonna say it to my face. And don't come here talking about it. And the funny part about it is y'all don't show y'all face, but then you talk about I ain't showing my face. I didn't show my face. People know what I look like. Okay, real talk. But this shit is just, just fucking funny, dad. I, I'm getting all this 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 feedback and backlash because i'm voicing my opinion but you saying well eminem oh those dudes are voicing their opinion well why can't i voice my opinion and say that i don't think eminem is good as people make him out to be he ain't i, I mean for real i mean what you getting upset for i just find this shit funny i really do I I find it's funny, but now I know what gets under um the clear people's skin. So that's why I'm gonna continue the you know what I'm saying to make these videos. And it don't take much to get under your skin due to the fact that it peels when you set set foot out in the sun. But it is what it is though. This your boy Town Biz, I'm out.